Hello there, this is Rupesh and you are watching CPVNet's video series on C++ and in this video we will be learning about comments in your program. So what is the comments? So we know how to print something like this. If you will print it like I love C++ and in next line you might be printing like this is good language. Okay. So if you will go and print this, it will print these two lines. Okay, there is no problem in this. But let's suppose you want to comment this out. Like if you don't want this line to get printed, either you remove it like this one, then only this will not get printed, right? But there is another way. Instead of removing this line, you can just do it like this. So this two time forward slash will make this as comment. Okay. So if you will run this program now, only one line will get executed. This is considered as comment and your program does not include that as a statement. It thinks like user is giving some message to the person whoever is reading your program. That's why it is called comment. Okay. Because whenever we write very big programs, it becomes very confusing when someone else is looking at your program because sometimes what happens? You have given some statement for some reason but someone else is looking at your statement and they are thinking something else so it is really very useful when you write a comment about your statement like what this statement is doing okay so you might be writing it like c is equal to x into x plus 34 and minus y into x okay so what is the meaning of this statement here if someone would look it they won't be able to understand it but let's suppose you have found some new formula and this is some formula like bingo formula okay so you will write it like bingo so someone will understand okay this is the bingo formula okay so it's like that you give some comment for something okay so this is executable but this is not executable because you have given into the comment but what if you want to give lots of lines as comment like bingo here and you are keep on writing something like this and you want this whole thing as a comment. So there is another way of doing that which is like forward slash hit this star button here and then star and then forward slash. Okay. So whatever is coming in between these two stars will become comment. Okay. So this is also a way of keeping comment and this is also a way. So this we generally use when you want to make so many lines as comment. Okay. So this is the way. So whatever will come in between these two stars will get commented and will not going to execute. Okay. So this was about comment and why we use that. Okay. So I'll see you in the next video. Bye bye.